If you're watching this to get like tips and tricks for the climb, one thing you definitely don't need is a Oh my God, I had such a nice sleep. It is quarter past 11 in the morning. I went to bed at like half nine, so I had about 12, 13, maybe 14 hours sleep. And one of the things that helped that is, when you turn off the light here, it's blackout. Now, let's see what the others are at. I have latest to get up. This is the kitchen, by the way. I didn't really get here yesterday. So Vincent went to get his hair cut this morning and he wasn't happy with it, so he went at it himself. <laughs> Vincent has entrusted me with trying to fix the back of his hair, so let's give this a go. The first activity from Santa Ana is to leave Santa Ana. We're heading to Lake Cotapeque, and I think the Uber is gonna cost, what did you think? About seven? Six dollars. Six dollars, that's not too bad, if we can all squeeze in. What? No, no there was no other. There's like six of us. Hola. Gracias. Yeah, that took ages. We paid about six dollars. Six dollars, we paid 15. Six dollars between? Six dollars for the two of us, yeah. Yeah, the menu isn't amazing in Captain Morgan, so we're gonna go next door and see if it's any better slash cheaper. To the right, Vincent. Vincent. Behind us. Oopsie. Now, let's get going. Whoops, you're recording. So we've settled on this place to get a little bit of food. Oi, oi. Hola. Currently trying to decide if I'm gonna jump off here. I think I'm gonna let Vincent be the, the guinea pig. <laughs> no. Nice, all right, I'll have to do it so. My name is Tommy Bubble. Hey, I'm scared. Tommy Bubble. <laughs> I thought he's gonna push me there, please don't. <laughs> don't, don't. Right. <laughs> End of the tarmac. What? Hola. Hola. <laughs> Hola. Morning. 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 <laughs> Let me in. Why would Vincent be packing five separate lunch boxes in two plastic bags? In a little bit of a rush this morning because we have an Uber booked for seven minutes. I'm running to get some coffee. We are doing a volcano hike today. I'll come back to you with the name of the volcano. I have other things to worry about right now, getting across this road safely. Yeah. Here we go. Quiero tres americano a uh, picante. Three, three Americanos, pic, uh, picante, are a year. Ocho ounces. Ocho ounces. Yeah, three Americanos. Okay. Gracias. Just as I'm blending in with this wall here, the volcano is called Ilamantepec, or some people just call it Santa Ana volcano, and apparently it's going to be really, really hot. <laughs> Hi. 
Is he a cancer doc? Okay. Uh, she died 20 years after. Alam Ishke. Alam Ishke. Ishin Ul. And there was like. Give me rings up by here. Oh my what what? I did it for that. Gracias. Gracias. We had a brief stop there to pay the park entrance fee, which was six dollars per person. Now we're on the move again. Stop, stop, stop. How's it going? Not too bad. Yeah, better than that Oh yeah. Just after another little break there, and apparently we have only about half an hour more to climb. I have to say, this is nowhere near as hard as Akatenango. This is the highest point in El Salvador. I didn't know that. We've got soldiers up here. I was gonna bring a jumper today and this guy said, no, no, it'll be really, really hot. Don't bring one. <laughs> Perfect. Can I get on the wall? <laughs> <laughs> you can just barely see the lake that we were at yesterday, which is annoying. Hopefully this cloud blows over. So loud and clear. It is absolutely freezing. I'm holding on to Sarah for dear life. Oh. You're not allowed to smoke in the volcano. <laughs> right, we're leaving before our guide and the rest of the group because it's just freezing. We're just down off the mountain there. We're rushing because apparently a bus leaves at one o'clock, so we came down very fast. If you're watching this to get like tips and tricks for the climb, one thing you definitely don't need is a guide. We paid three dollars each for that and there was no point. The trail was clearly marked. You needed really no help at any point. So yeah, you don't need that. The bus is here. I'll see you back in Santa Ana. When you just climb that mountain too hard. <laughs> all clean after our little mountain trek. It is our last full day here in Santa Ana and we really haven't seen any of the town so I think we're gonna go out and explore now. Apparently, this is the only Gothic church in Central America. A really, really small town, touristy enough. The people are lovely, I have to say. Yeah, there's just a really nice, genuine atmosphere around here. We're gonna go back to the hostel now, cook some dinner, probably take it easy. Tomorrow we move to a new location. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'll see you in the next one. We've just arrived at our first town called Apaneca, and we've come to the main tourist attraction here, which is the maze. So what are we doing? So we're going to the maze, and uh, we will time ourselves, and the quickest one wins, of course, but the loser will have to play the first round in the Super Bowl on Sunday, which will probably be Kylie. So we paid $5 thinking this would get us into the maze, but apparently it doesn't. We pay another $3. So Kylie's gonna talk to the guy and be like, why, $5 to get in to do 
Buah. 